ओके सो नेक्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू सी वॉट जॉन टेलर डिस्टॉशन रियली डज सो जॉन टेलर डिस्टॉशन इज अ डिस्टॉशन ऑफ अ नॉन लीनियर मॉलिक्यूल एंड इट रिड्यूस अ सिमेट्री एंड द एनर्जी ऑफ अ सिस्टम सो वेन वी टॉक अबाउट अ नॉन लीनियर मॉलिक्यूल वी टॉक अबाउट एनी मॉलिक्यूल विच इज नॉट लीनियर बेसिकली विच डज नॉट हैव एन एंगल ऑफ वन एटी डिग्री ओनली दिस इज अ लीनियर मॉलिक्यूल सी ओ टू बी ई सी एल टू ऑल ऑफ दोज आर लीनियर मॉलिक्यूल्स सो वी डू नॉट वॉन्ट दैट वी वॉन्ट अ नॉन लीनियर मॉलिक्यूल एंड इन दिस केस वी आर गोइंग टू स्पेसिफिकली स्टडिंग जॉन टेलर डिस्ट्रॉशन इन ऑक्टाहेड्रल कॉम्प्लेक्सेज सो जॉन टेलर इफेक्ट वॉट इट डज इज इट रिड्यूसेज द ओवरऑल सिमेट्री ऑफ योर मॉलिक्यूल इफ योर मॉलिक्यूल इज एंटायरली सिमेट्रिक इट्स गोइंग टू रिड्यूस दैट सिमेट्री एंड इट इज ऑल्सो गोइंग टू रिड्यूस द एनर्जी ऑफ दैट मॉलिक्यूल विच इज अ गुड थिंग बिकॉज वी ऑलवेज स्ट्राइव टू गो टू अ प्लेस विच हैज अ लोअर एनर्जी ओके द यूनिवर्स इन दिस बींग्स एंड इन ऑल यू बींग्स एवरी वन ट्राइज टू गो टू अ स्टेट ऑफ अ लोअर एनर्जी सो दैट इज वॉट जॉन टेलर डिस्ट्रॉशन डज इट ब्रिंग्स अ मॉलिक्यूल टू अ लोअर एनर्जी बाय डिस्ट्रॉइंग द ओवरऑल सिमेट्री ऑफ अ मॉलिक्यूल now how does this occur how does the john teller distortion dis- distort the symmetry of the molecule and reduce the energy of the molecule it does it by removing the electronically degeneracy electronically degeneracy is what the john teller distortion removes if your molecule or if your complex is not electronically degenerate like if it's a symmetric if the configuration is symmetric like it's d5 high spin it's a symmetric con- configuration in that case john teller distortion will not happen okay because there is no need to remove an electronic degeneracy because electronic degeneracy is not present so only in the complexes in which electronically degeneracy is present only those complexes are going to undergo john teller distortion and how they are going to undergo john teller distortion by removing of the electronic degeneracy how is that going to happen we'll see but first of all we need to see which all complexes or which are configurations john teller distortion will distort first of all is d1 now you have to remember that john teller distortion is going to occur in only those complexes or those configurations which will be unsymmetrically filled so d1 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 t2g is unsymmetrically filled so yes there will be john teller distortion here d1 configuration is going to show john teller distortion john teller distortion short form is also known as jtd next is d2 1 2 1 2 so both of them are going to go to t2g 1 and 2 again t2g is unsymmetrically filled so this is also going to show jtd now let's go to your d3 1 2 3 so again all of these are excited so 1 2 3 then they come to t2g 1 2 3 T2G is now symmetrically filled. E.g. has no electrons at all, and T2G is symmetrically filled. So no, this is not going to show any JTD. No JTD. So this molecule is not going to distort because of John Taylor distortion. Any molecule which has a D3 configuration is not going to distort. Then we have D4. So first of all, for D4 high spin, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four high spin means there is no pairing. So one, two, three, and Four, T2G is symmetrically filled, but E.G. is not symmetrically filled. E.G. is unsymmetrically filled, and because of the unsymmetricalness of the E.G., this molecule is going to show JTD, or this configuration is going to show JTD. Next, we come to D4 low spin. So in D4 low spin, the electrons are going to get paired. So T2G4, T2G4 is again it's not symmetrically filled. so this is also going to show john teller distortion next up we have d5 high spin so 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 and 5 high spin again no pairing t2g is symmetrically filled eg is also symmetrically filled both of them are symmetrically filled so this configuration is not going to show jtd so no jtd for this configuration let's go to d6 okay first of all d5 low spin 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 low spin means there is going to be pairing so 1 2 3 4 5 
4 and 5. So, now we have unsymmetricalness in the T2G. So, this configuration is going to show John Taylor distortion. Next up we have D6 high spin. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. EG is symmetrically filled but T2G is not symmetrically filled. So, this complex is also going to show John Teller distortion. No pairing again because it is high spin. So, now let us go to the low spin. 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, T2G symmetrically filled EG has no electrons. So, this is not going to show John Taylor distortion. Then we have D7, D7 high spin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. EG is symmetrically filled, but T2G is unsymmetrically filled. So yes, this configuration is going to show John Taylor distortion. Next up, D7 low spin. Seven electrons. Seven electrons. Low spin means pairing will happen. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. T2G is now symmetrically filled, but EG is unsymmetrically filled, which gives this or this is going to show John Taylor distortion.